I've been watching a lot of videos by the Young Turks recently, and the reaction from the media outlets supporting the right in regards to the recent shooting in a lot of my videos I am trying to change people's minds I am trying to make them see things from a different perspective that might make them agree with me that what is being done could be done better with that said if you're not hurting anyone, yourself included, then you can do what you want. You can believe what you want. And I might sometimes make fun of you as a type or a group or whatever, but I'm not doing it to score points or to try to consider people to not be that way simply because I'm using childish name-calling to do that. I'm not telling you not to listen to the, the media outlets that support the right. You can do so if you wish. I just... <clears throat> I sound way more... emotional than I am right now. Sorry, it's my voice. <clears throat> Just look at the different media outlets and try to see which ones actually say the positives for excuse me, both sides. Which ones excuse me. I don't know if all media outlets that support the right do this, but it's just when you hear O'Reilly call the other side nutty or loons and things of that nature, if you think that something is messed up, if it, you know, if you genuinely believe that something is just messed up, then just stating the facts should do it. You know, you don't necessarily have to put more emphasis on something. And as a reporter, you have an obligation. You're a, you're a journalist, man. You're supposed to be objective. You know. Did you sleep through that class? I'm not a reporter, so I get to say that. I'm not telling anyone to do something specific or not, or believe or say anything specific. I just want you to, to try to listen to the rhetoric that they use and try to see if... if they are able to admit if they've made a mistake, if they are able to admit if the other side is right about something. In a recent video by the Young Turks, they were criticizing a Chinese woman who was putting down, you know, I don't know, white American upbringing of children, I guess, and they said some of what she's saying is true, you know. I'm sorry, I've never heard a media outlet supporting the right say something I disagree with, you know, part of it is true. I've never heard that. I myself try to say if there is something, you know, that the other side is right about, or something where I can understand where they're coming from. You know, when, if, if I'm talking about a subject and it wouldn't completely mess up 
my point if I, at the same time, said something positive about them. You know, it's like when you're... When there is a current case of a rapist or a murderer, you don't want to be the jackass who stands up and says, well, maybe they were victims once. Yes, let's deal with the current situation. There are currently people crying over, you know, their loss, you know, be it life or, you know, yeah, let's deal with that. Then we can look at, or before they commit a crime, we can look at, you know, whether or not they're a victim. Yeah, I've made my point, so I'm going to turn the camera off now.